Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play Rooktag. Coin is life, the mercenaries in clan space, not clan home space, that is. Training day, I think, is the only mission we can do with just one guy. And we're up against whom? We don't know. But I'm pretty sure something interesting will cook up. So, we take the loot. Oh, we just have to send one guy. And it will be Squire, and he will be in the Phoenix Hawk. We have a a Dervish. That's not that bad. So, here we go. Let's hope for the best. Command interface initiated. Okay. Uh, we have to be a little bit careful because these guys are not allowed to die. Oh, we have help. Excellent. So is there any any good ground for us? I think here. Here is pretty okay. The higher, the better. The more woody, the better. I think this is pretty much okay. They have... We have an extended range, streakers from six, fire bee, no problem, dervish, no problem, phoenix, no problem. They only have trash, and they call themselves health horses. That is not a lot of health horses, if you ask me. It's more like donkeys. We have a Valkyr, that's a piece of garbage, and <laughs> battle armor, like what? And a locust crap version the basic version okay uh we'll we'll, 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 we'll manage Commander. this guy is smoking which can mean two things either he is already damaged or which is far more likely he's equipped with not a fusion engine but some kind of primitive diesel engine <coughs> which is the most likely version i think these guys are idiots that's how it comes. Because this is all garbage. Phoenix, don't let yourself be fooled. That is garbage machines. The Phoenix is not a Phoenix Hawk. That's the old... I don't think they're not even related. <gasps> Mine dispensers! Oh boy, we will have fun. Well, yeah, sadly we cannot we cannot fire right or can we? Yeah, no weapon can fire its first turn. I don't care if they die. They're built to die. These guys are flying, like, really flying. Quite good, quite good, quite good. We will have so much fun with you guys. Now, uh, we're not that well armored, right? I thought that a mind dispenser would be not single use. Oh well. Yeah, that will stop the guy. I'm out of short range missiles. Waiting for orders. He doesn't strike me as someone who has any real form of jump jets or something like that, so we'll reserve. We'll just play it cool, you know. Valkyr, normally a very good machine. This Valkyr, however, not. Valkyrie. Waiting for orders. Uh, 
I don't want to shoot people who are not moved and fired yet because what will happen is that he will take basically no damage. Yeah, he's got equipped with rifles and, and rocket launches and I mean not cannons but rifles. <gasps> Look at that guy. Wow. That was like impressive. Yeah. Structure exposed doesn't do anything at this point. Just allows us to hit him critically if need be. Oh boy, this guy's gonna die. Yes, Commander. This guy's gonna die hardcore, I tell you that much. This is not the real enemy force. This is just some garbage. Yes, Commander. Order acknowledged. Confirmed. Nothing. Attack failed. I think I'm interested in the Oh yeah. I think I'm interested in the um, Dervish, because that's a good machine. We can make something out of that Dervish guy. I'm a little bit hesitant about this guy here. Nothing. What? Okay, whatever. That was something big. Receiving you. Aye, aye. Wondering if I should try more fire on that Centurion. Because he is really easy to hit. On the other hand, though... Yeah. Confirmed. Firing. That should kill this guy. Ah, he's not dead. He's unstable, uneasy, un-everything, but he's not dead. I hope it's not more Hell's Horses they're getting their hands on. Just fire. Copy. Yeah, engine destroyed. Target it was a primitive engine, so what did we what did we think would happen? Interestingly good shooting. By. We have to deal with this guy here now. Oh, if we shoot him and miss him with the PPC, what will happen is that our minds will go away. But we did hit, so we're okay. Okay, they, they will fight each other, hopefully. Coyote, clan coyote. These guys are nuts. Let, let's, let's say it as it is. These guys are mentally challenged. Okay, we're overheating a little bit, but not critically. The piranha, piranha? 
might be a problem. But the others will get reinforcements as well. Why are they not fighting each other? They should be fighting each other. Maybe they can fight each other because... Maybe they can fight each other because it's first turn. Although that's unlikely. It doesn't make any sense. Wow. Wow, what a shot. That means he has got a um, heavy periphery rifle thingy going on. Okay. I really have to deal with this guy. I don't want to get hit by that weapon. No, sir. It's not an AC-20, but it's, you know, close enough. I should lay more mines, hmm? But that would be a waste on this. Oh, everything misses. Great. Nothing. He already got his pound of flesh by killing the tank. No idea what he's doing. He's going right in the middle. He's playing with everyone. That's a stupid idea. The best thing he can do is just blow up. Overload reactor and just go haywire. That's the best thing he can do for me. Receiving you. I have to deal with this guy. Primitive or not, that guy is a problem. That hit felt pretty good. Primitive, always primitive. Don't think I can upgrade him to anything that is useful to me. What is his initiative? Nine, okay. Yeah, everyone is basically going after everyone. Okay. Anything? No, he's still, you know, he's just standing there saying, take it, give it to me, I like it. They're making their little everyone goes after everyone thing there. No, he's not. He's actually going nuts. I have an idea, but it's a stupid idea. Engaging with target. The good thing is... I'm out of short range um... That now, wherever there's mines, that will stop them from moving too much, and that means they will shoot each other, hopefully, a little bit better. I'm here. On one hand, I should really, really deal with this guy. On the other hand, I have to deal with the Centurion. Heavy rifles is a problem. Okay, you're dead now, right? You're dead. He's at one health. Oh crap, they're killing the battle armor. There goes my allies. Very bad choice. Standing by. Okay, you could technically 
try to finish this guy off. Okay. Uh, no, 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 no. We shoot the leg. Engine destroyed, heavy oh, rifle destroyed. Okay, impressive firepower, give him that. And yes, we're taking a lot of heavy hits, that's not good. We need to get out of here. This back armor is rather, if we can get one hit off, that should do something. No, it didn't do anything. But he's open in the back. We cannot take any advantage of that, sadly. Yep, the dervish is dead. Are there any, any hostile forces left down there? Does the fire be? They're not really good at fighting each other. Okay, my battle armor just died. As expected. Okay. The chances to hit are super bad, but I have to act against this piranha. You don't want to have one of these guys in your back. And he just takes it and likes it. It's not the best chances, but it's what we have. Nothing! That is a pretty big tank, right? Yeah, hitting chances are not not existing against this guy. I wonder if that is a good idea. Maybe it's too aggressive. But if we can hit this guy really hard. No, didn't do anything. Yeah, a little bit there, a little bit there. Nothing. We could, because technically... Technically, uh, we cannot hit our own machine because the angle is not the same. You're kidding me. Okay, we have turret mounted, so we're okay. Take this. 
Good, good, good. Enemy eliminated. What's up, boss? On my way. We're way too close for our own good. Giving them everything I've got. Engine crit. Yeah, we're in bad shape. We should actually reserve. Don't play the hardball until we absolutely have to. Okay, that was bad. Commander. Can we hit him? Ooh, melee chances are actually quite high. Kick. From the back. Try it. Negative damage. And we missed everything. And he's got the highest, highest initiative of all. But at least he's not really doing anything with it. Confirm. There's nothing else we can do anyway. The Cicata at the moment, she's in bad shape. Roger. Oh, come on, honestly. They're fighting their best fight of their lives. We have to deal with this piranha above everything else Mother? next. Because that piranha, I tell you, that piranha will be a problem. If I miss, if I miss, which, which I will most likely do, what will happen is that the minefield disappears. And if the minefield disappears, all hell will break loose. So that is the worst possible option. I. Let's hope we don't miss. I. Well, good thing is, we did miss, but we didn't destroy the minefield. So we're kind of still okay. Oh, boy, that was a good hit. The fire bee can feel it. Orders. Can I punch you? I can kick you and shoot you. It's not the best option, but... Yeah, that should have done something. His leg is off. He's on the ground. And he's dead. Very important. Very, 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 very important. We have to deal with this guy above all else. Miserable shooting. Obviously. The Piranha will not survive it. No way in hell. Question is, how do we kill them? <laughs> we should not walk into our own minds if possible. Damage to our allies is unimportant. Wow. He just moved through the entire minefield. 
Very impressive. Sikat are never a good machine. I mean, there are versions with the PPC, but even they... Not good. Let's hope we don't blew this one up. Um... Yeah, that should have done something. Left leg destroyed. That means he's out of the fight. He's a light machine. Without a leg, he's downed. He didn't push out, though. Yeah, he ejected. Okay. Yes, Commander. Very good. Ince. The enemy is down to one machine. We will wait. I've got no idea what he's up to. Commander. He has to move, make the move. Don't move in the minefield. Okay. The fire bee, if I get it right, is a Liao machine, originally. Um... That's all we wanted. Are we too close? No, we're not. We're fine. All right. Mr. Firebee, you're open on all sides. That's the last one. All primary targets dead. Good work. And here we go. Extra payment, 50,000, 50,000. Very good, very good, very good. Damage to us is minimal. None to be exact, because these are not ours. Loot is impressive. Nitra style, the armor is too low. 50 ton, first generation battle mech. Shock Trooper, that's not that bad. The Piranha. 12 X2 rotary machine guns. Woutsies. Woutsies. Rose laser. Primitive cockpit. Sounds insane. But we'll take we cannot take this guy on top. No, we cannot. The original version of the one one four. That's the primitive centurion, right? Primitive downgrade. Odin scout tank. Medium pulse laser clans. Dual machine guns. This is very impressive. A clan XL engine, that's impressive. Primitive cockpits. Clan armor. It's built in case, which is really good. Um, a mining drill, we're not interested. Clan endo steel, we're very interested. Dual machine guns. Ah, oh, you can do beautiful stuff with that, can you? You can indeed. This, this is where it gets. Clown medium pulse lasers. A centurion part, an engine. Machine gun ammo. So, well, it depends mainly how badly it's damaged. Let's have a look. Oh boy. It's 
Let's look at him. Primitive engine, XL engine. So we can upgrade him. Endo steel and everything. And he, we can make him into a missile boat. Right? A quite impressive missile boat, if we play our cards right, that is. Yeah, not the worst. Not the worst. We will manage. So the question is, we're five days off until all pilots are fully operational again. So what we should do is... Yes, we can make the Kid Fox active, but that doesn't help any. This will not do anything. And getting this guy back on his feet... Is 12 days, so it's out of the question. At this point. What we can do is upgrade what we have. This guy has the PPC and the SRM4. Could put that out and give him the SRM streak, which is 9 heat, which is 6 heat. So he will run a little bit hotter than before. But still okay. The PPC has a heat of 13. So there is nothing we can do here, sadly. Armor is okay. I want to do something about the... Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. We can put endo steel into this guy. That saves some tonnage. And we can put ferro fibrous into this guy. That saves some tonnage. Yes, it costs money, but then we'll have tonnage left. And this engine is... Okay, we have a small problem, but he would become faster. 5A, which is beautiful. 5-8, which is beautiful. It's four days. We have five days in total. So this would work if we're able to reduce the heat, a the tonnage a little bit, like putting out one heat sink. And then reducing the armor. Like this. We would be faster, significantly faster, by the way, and we don't treat the damage that much, but that's okay. I like the idea of this. Now, you could argue we're upgrading something that is not worth it. Okay, let's wait one day. Two day. Three day. Four days. Okay. Is there anything new in the store? No. No, there is not. On the hot hand. Um, we could, we should, but should we? Actually, we do not, we do not need that. And all our important machines are ready for battle. I mean, this could be better though, but that's okay. He's faster now. Next thing is we have to upgrade this guy's speed. But that's beyond the point, right? None of these. So I think we'll see each other next time. Until then, bye.